Before we start, make sure you are running Evernote 10.117.1. I never understood this numbering system, software numbering system. <laughs> anyway, what I want to show you is not this, but this is also uh, uh, something that is new uh, on 117.1. You can now click this three dots here and create a notebook from here. Okay, let me show you what I want to show you because this is something that I've been waiting for so many years. Okay, we need a browser for that. Uh, and I'm going to start here the incognito mode, meaning that this window has no cache, so there is no Evernote uh, account link to it, nothing. Now let's go back to Evernote. And from here, we'll first share this note. This didn't change, this was here before. And also this here didn't change, it was here before, can view and can edit. So we're changing this to can edit. But if you paid attention, you saw it here. It, this is new, there is one part here which is new. The word anyone was in here before, uh, especially here, because anyone with the link in the past could see the note, but anyone with the link can now edit the note. This is big. So let's grab the link. I'm going to copy the note link from here. And we're going to this window here without any account because this is like a, a fresh browser. So there's no account link to this, to this note here, to this browser here. And we are opening that note. Okay, in the past we could open it and that that is not new. By the way, if you like what I do here, please subscribe to the channel, it helps a lot. So pretend that this black window here is someone else, okay? So I can now, do something like this. Hi. <laughs> and this is my Evernote. So anyone, this is an important thing. This is an important detail. Anyone with this link can edit this note. So we can do all this. Let's drag this a little bit here. So we can use any of this formatting here. So let's say one, two, and so on. And it's so fast. It's amazing. I'm, I'm, I'm impressed. It feels like it's even faster than before. Okay. Let's, so let's do it the other way around. Let's do it on this side here. Let's see how fast it is. Hi. Wow. It's super fast. So you can do all this. You can, for example, use this marker here, you can make this, uh, I don't know, change the font. I'm impressed with how fast it is. Uh, wow, and that's it. There's nothing else to see, <laughs> but it's so cool. But pay attention, be careful, because again, anyone with the link can edit this. and. One thing that I wish they add in the future are those uh, collaboration indicators. You know, when you're collaborating with someone and the line, the, the little blue thing, red thing pops up here and you know that someone is collaborating with you. So if you wanna make sure no one else will see or be able to add that note, make sure you are sharing, let's click here, using the email address, okay? And of course, you can revoke the access by changing the status. We can uh, make it read only. People can only view the note or you can remove the sharing uh, altogether. So there is no more sharing. You have to change it here to restricted access. So no one else will have access to that note. It will take a little while for the browser to uh, change the status, but it will change. And at some point, this person will not, the person with the link because we changed the status will not be able to 
edit or see in this case because we uh, made the note we we converted the note back to a, a local note nobody else can see this note okay that's it for this one if it was helpful i'd appreciate a thumbs up and if you want to help even more please consider supporting my work on patreon or youtube you can also buy me a coffee thanks for watching see you soon oh there it is it's gone <laughs> no more editing is possible Bye.